do birds, alligators, and dinosaurs all have in common? They're inescapably tied to the same family tree, a tree that dates back 230 million years, with one branch leading to the evolution of crocodiles and alligators, and the other branch expanding into dinosaurs, and eventually to their nearest kin, birds. So one of the best ways to understand dinosaurs is to study the similarities and differences they share with their closest living relatives. Alligators look a lot like how we'd imagine dinosaurs if they were living today, with scaly armor-plated skin and a lethal set of chompers. But ironically, that's just a coincidence. They're actually quite different. One way to tell them apart is that most reptiles have bent legs that spread out alongside their body. Many dinosaurs, whether on two feet or four, walked with their legs underneath them. Another distinction is in their metabolism. Alligators and crocs are sluggish and slow, cold-blooded animals. They aren't able to maintain a constant body temperature, but rather they take on the temperature of their surroundings. And even though it's still a controversial topic within the paleontologist world, Recent findings suggest that dinosaurs just may have been warm-blooded and highly active creatures, despite the way they're depicted in popular Hollywood movies. But these two cousins do share a very interesting trait involving air and the way that they breathe. Along with their third family member, birds, they all possess a hyper-efficient breathing system probably evolved from a common ancestor. It's called one-way airflow an intricate network of air sacs that help extract and provide a constant flow of oxygen into the lungs with each breath. Twice as much oxygen, in fact, as humans can pump through their lungs. When comparing birds and dinosaurs, however, there are numerous traits that meat-eating dinosaurs like T-Rex share with their direct descendants. The most groundbreaking characteristics were discovered in 1861, where a strange 150 million year old fossil was found buried deep within a mine. Archaeopteryx was an enigma the size of a crow, only with razor-sharp teeth. It resembled more of a lizard, but with feathered wings. This discovery provided the first hard evidence that some dinosaurs evolved into birds. Then, in 1994, a Chinese farmer named Li Yin Fang discovered a completely intact dinosaur fossil, about the size of a turkey, and covered in hair-like down feathers. It was called Sinoceropteryx, and its feather-like filament was a crucial link between landlocked dinosaurs and modern winged birds. Birds, alligators, and dinosaurs forever linked in evolutionary history. And just like any family tree, not every member looks and acts the same. But one thing can be said about this motley crew, they all have one nasty bite. <laughs>